baby, yeah! All right. I'm just getting set up here. My first setup didn't work very well. It's the second day, but they're always up here in my clover field. I'm just strutting away, so that's what I'm hoping for. I set up here in my blind, and I'm gonna hopefully put the I'm gonna put the decoys out, and hopefully something comes in, and something starts talking. It was slow this morning. I thought I saw him last night in the field. Thought he'd talk, but he never talked at all. But now I'm gonna try, and I'm self-filming, so if any video's a little choppy or something, sorry about that, but it's a little tough whenever you're self-filming and you get excited like I do, but wish me luck.
Well, today's the second day. This must be a ritual for me because last year I shot my bird in the same exact spot right here. But he shot him right there, he shot him right here. So 10 yards difference basically. Bl same blind, but he just came different route. But this is my second setup this morning. He, my first one, I didn't hear nothing. And then I came up here and I was like, I'll just sit in the good old clover patch from Wait Tail Institute. And it paid off. I was caught, gave a couple calls, it was quiet. And then all of a sudden he just lit up, came the whole way from back there. Came to there, and right down to here. I gobbled at him a couple times with the strutter I had out in the hen, and then that must have been enough to convince him to come over. But he sure had my heart pumping. Awesome. 